Somali Prime Minister Mohamed Roble continues to engage with Jubaland leaders to bring reconciliation ahead of the upcoming elections. This week, he has attended a meeting of the State Council of Ministers in Kismayo. He was able to take in the opinions of the officials on many issues. They included cooperation between federal government ministries and state ministries, acceleration of government development projects, reconciliation and administration of elections, humanitarian affairs, security, and the fight against al-Shabaab. Somali Education Minister Abdullahi Haji joined Roble in the meeting. The Prime Minister has learned information about the activities of the Jubaland Cabinet and listened to the challenges the ministries face. He has ordered ministers to meetings with their federal counterparts and analyzing Luga to help solve any obstacles there. Roble promised to intensify development projects in Jubaland. While security was discussed with the ministers, later in the day the Prime Minister headed to the front lines to get an assessment from commanders there. The 43rd Division of the Somali National Army is based in Kismal. They cooperate closely with Kenyan troops operating under the Amasam Command. Roble was presented with an evaluation of the current fight against al-Shabaab terrorists. He praised the recent progress in securing territory and foiling terrorist attacks. The Prime Minister also promised more support from Mogadishu. I visited today the command of the 43rd Division of the Somali National Army, the heroes of CXD. We are grateful for their dedication to defending the country and the people. We are committed to responding to the needs of our troops in terms of equipment, training and support they need. Jubaland President Ahmed Madobe was by Roble's side throughout the day and indeed throughout the Prime Minister's entire visit. ADN-TV will continue to report on political developments in Somalia and throughout Africa.